take this time personally to thank Mark for his contributions to music. A little trivia, Mark and I graduated from Ithaca College in the same year, and I won't tell you when. Uh, oh yeah, yeah, there we go. Um, but I also have had the privilege to and honor to work with three beautiful and talented daughters of yours. So Mark, could you come down and uh, we would like to present you with your musician of note of the board, um, very deserving young man. I said young. Yeah. Yeah. To sing under his leadership, and uh, from my own personal experience, I consider Mark a great friend and mentor, and I'm thankful for the opportunities that he provides me in the uh, folk group that we have at Resurrection Parish. Once his award is presented, we'll give Mark the opportunity uh, to say a few words that uh, he missed due to his illness last year. I'm sorry to get back. <laughs> pleasure to, to be here tonight as a former teacher of mine and a former student are, are both inducted. And many people that are inducted as I watched over the years had a lot of connections with and it was just a pleasure to see. Um, the people, of course, thank you to the church choir that came from Resurrection Parish. Uh, I really appreciate that. That was a wonderful, wonderful song. Thank you. I've been uh, very, very thankful uh, as I learn from my students as much as they learn from me. Um, everybody has touched my life. I think any teacher will say that. Um, their accomplishments, the students' accomplishments, are really what makes everything worth it. Whether it's a student that just sings in the choir or somebody that learned a guitar chord from you or um, somebody that made all nationals. I'm uh, very fortunate to have students uh, that, that achieve at high levels. And that's so important as a teacher, as all of you teachers know. I want to, of course, uh, thank my family, um, Lauren, my wife, and my three wonderful daughters, Madison, and Lisa, and Abigail. Um, I don't know if, uh, if you noticed, but I really think they've all surpassed me in musical talent. And I'm so glad to watch them on the stage or perform or in Lauren's case, teach. It's just wonderful to see them. Congratulations, I love you all. <laughs> and of course, uh, you know, um, my parents, Bernie and Kathy, who are both here tonight. Um, Bernie couldn't sing, but he was probably singing from his seat, uh, and Kathy was up there singing. Um, I do, do want to thank them for everything. They still sing in my church choir, they still come to my musicals and things at Alexander, even on the most smelliest nights. Uh, Deanna, uh, it's just wonderful, as you mentioned about your parents, it's the same thing for me. Thank you, Mom and Dad. And I can't forget those times when I was 12, maybe younger. Maybe. I just remember I had to get up. There was no question to ask. A half an hour earlier than the bus came, and I better be practicing that piano for a half an hour in the morning. And I hated it then but I thank you so much for that now. <laughs> and again, uh, Sean and Jane, over and over, thanks, uh, and everybody that was involved in this, this uh, whole committee thing. It's just a wonderful ceremony to come see as a graduate, as a former teacher here. Uh, just congratulations to you guys. Uh, I really think this is wonderfully done, and of course, Paul and Janice, everybody that was involved, good job. And thank you again. Have a great night.